Hello and welcome to episode 474 of the Flex and Historian. For this episode, we're going to be taking a quick look at the United States Air Force Thunderbirds. The Thunderbirds are the United States Air Force's Air Demonstration Squadron. They were activated as an aerobatic unit on the 25th of May of 1953, making them the third oldest active aerobatic team after the French Patrol de France in 1931 and the United States Navy Blue Angels in 1946. They were originally based out of Luke Air Force Base in Arizona from 1953 to 1956, but since 1956 have been based out of Nellis Air Force Base in Nevada. The team currently flies displays with six General Dynamics F-16C Fighting Falcon multi-role fighter jets, four of which fly the main displays, while two more fly solo routines. The Thunderbirds also fly a pair of F-16D two-seat fighter trainers, as well as having a Boeing C-17 Globemaster III support transport. The first aircraft that the Thunderbirds operated was the Republic F-84G Thunderjet, which they operated from 1953 until 1955. In 1955, they switched over to the swept-wing Republic F-84F Thunderstreak, which they operated until June of 1956. In June of 1956, the team transitioned to the North American F-100C Super Sabre, which they used until 1964 when they made the switch to the Republic F-105 Thunder Chief. However, a crash due to, the due to a structural failure caused the team to revert back to the Super Sabre, this time the F-100D, which they flew until 1968. In 1969, the Thunderbirds made another transition, this time to the McDonnell Douglas F-4E Phantom II, which they operated until 1973. Due to the 1973 oil crisis, in 1974, the Thunderbirds switched to the more economical Northrop T-38 Talon jet trainer, which they flew until 1982, when four of their Talons made a controlled flight into terrain at the bottom of a loop during training. This accident was one of the driving forces behind the Thunderbird switch to their current platform, the General Dynamics F-16 Fighting Falcon, which they have flown since 1983. For the purpose of the video today, we are in FSX Steam Edition, and we are flying the old Payware F-16D Fighting Falcon from Iris Simulations. So without further ado, let's turn the sound on and hop in the cockpit. Transitioning into the vertical.
Don't think. Don't think. Don't think. Altitude. Well, folks, that concludes episode number 474 of the Flight Sim Historian, featuring the United States Air Force Thunderbirds.